Gentlemen, good afternoon. My name is Mario van den Heuvel. I'm your purser today on this KLM flight to Amsterdam. And on behalf of the entire cabin staff, I would like to thank you. It's going to be a northeasterly departure followed by left turn towards north north. So what's up everybody and welcome back to a new episode. Guys, I'm in the Netherlands. I'm taking the train from Amsterdam to Rotterdam. My friends Johannes and Lucas are going to pick me up there. We will do some fishing today. They have a good spot for night on Zander. I'm pumped. I'm here for the next three days and you will be live. Today maybe I won't film. It's the first day. You will just see like short pictures or videos. But tomorrow I'm going to have the camp with me. See you. Okay. Opa, ja, ja, ich mach schon, ich mach schon. Oh. Er hat was gelegt, don't worry. Uh, 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 uh. Hecht, hecht, hecht. It's a pike! Jesus Christ! Okay, ich lande ihn hier. Nothing to thank for. So expect for the pike we didn't catch anything so we are changing the spot.
Johannes is slaying. Good spot. You got my pike. Johannes is slaying it. It's a big pike. No, <lacht> Der haut sicher mein Gufe im Morgen. new spot so got a first fish Feel strong. Hey. No, keine Ahnung. Schau mal. Uh, Zander. Zander. Zander, Zander, Zander. Zander. Good. Opa! <lacht> Bitte. Bitte, Dank. Nice. Dankeschön. Bitte, Bitte. Bitte, thanks. Der wollte ihn. Leck mich. Oh mein Gott. Jetzt brauche ich eine Zange. Nein, da nicht. Bye-bye. Oh man. Oh man. It's a door. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, so you're welcome. Show it in the cam. Nice. Ich glaube, es sind Barsche. Ich tue mir jetzt ein schwereres Blei, aber einen kleinen Gummi auf. Jetzt mache ich was ganz crazy. Crazy Malaysi Chasey Basy.
Hmm, what could it be? Hmm. Ja, schaut so aus wirklich. Und sie fischen schon. Wie fischt's? Es wird mir so laut. Ich bin ja gerade am Fuß Warte, ich schau mal nochmal an. Leg den Käse schon mal nur her. Wobei, was der, das ist ungefähr ein Hitz, was ich jetzt Ah, ja, fit schon. Ich Fisch. Das Perfekt, thank you. That's a nice perch. I guess close to 40 centimeters. Good morning, dear friends, followers and party people. It's the third day. What? Why the third day? Because the second day sucked big chungus. I got one fish. I got a pike. It wasn't the biggest one. 60 centimeters maybe. I thought it was a perch. It turned out to be a pike. Lucas didn't catch nothing. The only one who caught some fish was Johannes. Especially in the night when we went to a new spot. He was the only one figuring it out. He got a few sander, a decent one as well. While Lucas and me couldn't catch a fish and we just like lost. We just snacked a lot. Later on, we had some nice fish and chips. It was pretty nice, but well, fishing wise, the second day sucked. So there's no video about it. Now it's the third day, last day. The guys are already on the water behind me there. I'm coming, I'm catching up. 100 meters and then I will join them. Hope that the last day is going to be good. And I hope that you like the video guys. So just enjoy the few last hours with me.
Oh yeah, that's a pike spot. Why not? I'll take it. Gut, dann machen wir das. So, wie tief ist es denn? Ist es wirklich in 9 Meter? Nein, hier ist nicht so tief. Alter, it's extra rutschy. No? Oh, nein. Nah. Nein, die Strömung. Ja, Fisch. Die Strömung. Mir war nur Kescher recht, weil es so rutschig ist, um ehrlich zu sein. Nicht weil er so groß ist. So. Right. Not the biggest, but Put your fist. Good morning everybody, it's 8.20 in the morning, as you can see I'm on the train from Breda to Amsterdam Schiphol Airport. It's the end of the Netherlands trip, first time, yay! So, to summarize it, first day rocked, didn't rock, I mean, don't misunderstand me, I got a few fish, I got the first, the first fish was a zander, afterwards I got a perch, in the evening I got two zanders. Second day really sucked. I got this one pike, it was so hard. And unfortunately the third day wasn't much better. I got one perch. The last two days have been hard for me and Lucas. Lucas didn't catch nothing on the second day. He got a nice zander yesterday, the last fish of the trip. Johannes also yesterday got just one perch, but the day before he really like, he slayed, he got a lot of fish. We were fishing this one Xander spot and Lucas and me couldn't get anything and he was like just catching fish and fish. However, to summarize it, I'm very happy that I did that. It's a great fishing destination, I have to say. Um, I have to say although there are a few other minuses which are pretty obvious for me and I, I didn't expect them. First of all, we're in this area, there's a lot of people and everything, but you don't have any opportunities to, to buy something you for, for eat. You don't have a lot of restaurants. You don't have a lot of shopping opportunities, especially groceries, close to you, so you have to drive around. Second of all, the accommodation is quite expensive, I have to say. Um, 
and especially the, the, the freaking rules. I mean, we are renting an, a, a wooden house for 150 bucks and then you have like to clean everything by yourself and so on and so on. I mean, why do I rent it? I mean, what's the next? Should I maybe repair something which is broken there? I mean, I have never encountered something like that. However, let's get put push that aside. I'm very happy, it was a nice trip. Got a few nice fish, many great memories with great friends and I will definitely repeat it. I hope you enjoyed this episode. It should have been like at least two or three episodes, like a mini series, however, based on the on the catch or what we didn't catch. It's just one episode. So guys, thank you. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit the like button. See you next time. Thank you.